I choose to transform my life resolving past issues with strength courage and will power Namaste workers welcome new viewers cross watchers and my lovely lovely moonians today we will be looking into guidance coming in for the month of September and beyond so let's see what's coming in for you guys and before i forget today is the uh, aquarius full moon and on the 22nd and the virgo season has started so happy birthday to you all so let's see what's coming in okay too many things soul retrieval and we have rejuvenation also coming in taking the time to find your own inner peace happiness um bringing in in a calm rest and rejuvenation pampering or self care self directed thoughts um a renewal could be happening you could be giving yourself a rebirth of sorts we have the personal power coming in wow power animal and we have chrysolite chrysotile coming in with number 20 20 20th of a month 20 as a number could be of significance but there is balance which is going to bring in a new change which is happening you are balancing the way you are looking at love family um career also quite balanced outlook the way you are approaching things from centered in your own inner power is the energy which is coming in this is the time to bring thought to your actions is also coming in new beginnings could be opening up for you with the way the bear is over here going to places which have spiritual powers or like the hills or the beaches whatever it is however you can experience that landscape even through sc screen for some reason i'm being asked is going to gi give you a sense of calm and that calmness is very creative like something is beginning energy which is coming in at the bottom we have number 8 with crystal blessing grandmother crystal deva and we have cathedral library coming in a lot of inner knowledge which is coming in your ancestors are with you is also coming through the eagle the bear could be of relevance could be of relevance to with the 20 could be an age also a birth date but it's like two completions which have happened recently you have undergone a period of closing in two chapters or look at two chapters which are coming to an end no have come to an end lessons learned or karmic bonds which were released that kind of a thing end of two chapters that could be of relevance also you could be gaining full closure in regards to certain two past events in your life and letting go of that and finding your inner power to move out of that hurt is also coming through but a lot of this ambitious drive inspiration happiness contentment in your own self feeling whole that you are enough is giving you a lot of acceleration is what i'm feeling the card coming in is six of cups coming through certain past events could be again coming in only to help you find your own final closure in a closure and releasing that healing that is coming in certain kind of awakening your playful side will be fun is also coming through certain kind of childhood memory which may be resurfacing so understand why is it coming in and ask your inner child what would he she or they however you resonate like to do today something fun that kind of a thing this also has a soul mate energy coming through so new opportunities you could be pulling in your soul mate also is coming through and soul mates needn't always be love romantic but they all help us grow propel in our soul journey also 
but that's a very lovely love lovely lovely energy which is coming in a lot of motherly care which is coming through i want to say something but i don't know i don't want to i'll just say like your ancestors are with you grandmother is coming in very very strongly so if you're found remembering them her remember the cherishable fond memories you've had with her is also coming through we have the seven of cups coming in certain kind of clarity which is very much required and the king of cups also coming through which is really nice i feel like certain kind of healing that you may be doing but you are growing on your soul journey your soul is advancing elevating and that is bringing in a lot of opportunities for you to find your one the king of cups is someone who is like very warm very thoughtful very aware very helping also has deep feelings may not always have the confidence of showcasing what they feel cups are water signs and they are cancer pisces and scorpio could be in your chart or another person or those seasons could be of relevance also their season i feel like you're finally getting a control over your emotional world and that is empowering your life overall that sense of confidence that sense of sec be feeling secure feeling strong feeling charged and that clear sense of who you are what your expectations are in a relationship and everything getting clearer and clearer take the time to visual visualize yourself in your full potential and bring back that energy into your present see how does that make you feel that kind of a thing is coming in but a very tender loving connection is going to enter your world is also coming through or this this could be like someone will be coming in professing their love is also coming through and that may be very very unexpected is coming in keep your mind open your soulmate may differ from your usual type and we have page of swords also coming in someone who's trying to make a clear decision and maybe page of swords also has that spy energy trying to collect as much information they can someone can to further on understand you as you are vibing in your strong auric field they are getting mesmerized and it's getting them confused because they had different plans for themselves and you came in and that's changed their perspective their priorities in a certain way someone who is learning could be you or another person who is learning how to express themselves emotionally too they may have taken a look at this connection or relationship that you both have a little more practically is coming in but now they are navigating their way the strength to speak the truth to you is also coming through all right let's see what those romance angels have for you what do we have for virgos choose make decisions which are empowering for you self empowering beneficial for you is also coming through if you feel that someone is being has been trying to suppress you it's time to step it up now you don't have to be aggressive in all of that you can remain in your power but it's now time to stand in your stance is coming in but it's just a very protective energy that i'm getting towards you so i'm just saying whatever is coming in i'm not thinking at all but i have to keep coming back to six of cups over here and there's a lot of fulfillment which will be happening if you have been wondering why certain relationships which were very very good came to an end you will be finding that missing piece in a certain way and understanding what you could learn from that and perhaps also like you have been taking your turns and coming back on the path and now you realize why certain things did not happen certain rejections came in favor for you from the universe as a protection and you're meeting the one for you that kind of a energy is coming in all right okay <clears throat> we have release your ex this 
the time has come to clear your energy yeah the final closure which is essential now could also be the other person in question if there is someone of interest someone new who who someone new who is entering your life is undergoing this period so that's really really nice because they also want a clean slate before coming towards you or oh, this is something which will really really help you i was talking about final closure maybe talking about it to the person the same person or talking to a confidant someone you really trust or journaling it certain kind of releasing which will really really help you the chapter has to come to an end now release the lingering energies and you'll find a lot of clarity from there because things have been cloudy for some time we have finances and career coming in financial issues are a factor right in your love life right now at the bottom it says it is safe for you to love open your heart and give and receive the highest energy of all give your relationship a chance work on your partnership see that's up to you completely very soon clearly decide what you want so that it come so that it comes to you now someone may be busy or burying themselves in work prioritizing that that is why the connection may have not advanced as it would normally is coming through the but the mirage is coming to an end is also coming in someone needs to also focus on their fine personal life to create a real sense of balance in their life what's the energy of this spirit what's the energy of these two cards can you get some clarity okay we have appreciation coming in number 15 coming through you know how, what this feels like someone who's focusing on the past getting hurt carrying the pain of the past and worrying about their future or completely fi being fixed on a future milestone and not being able to appreciate the present the now is coming through over here you may have walked away from this person and an ex could be coming in an apology could also be coming through things were left unsaid now will be said but i honestly feel like you know it's your choice the choice is completely yours whatever path you want to choose will bring you ample amount of happiness is what is coming in to make a decision which empowers you is coming in again and again i want to see what kind of also one thing they really really appreciate you you may have a more optimistic positive you bring in a lot of positive vibe into people's lives there may be thorns and like you know drying bushes but this lady over here the divine feminine i'll say is holding on to the rose and appreciating it appreciate the moment is like spirit is telling me not to talk about love so much but how do we empower ourselves that kind of a self focus which is coming through quite a bit you may have gone through some choppy waters is also coming through and there's a lot of reward which will be coming in for you i apologize if the lighting's not so bright at the moment i just transferred new fish into the tank from the pond above so i just want them to get comfortable i don't want to overwhelm them at night with so much brightness all right so we have i anchor the boundless light in my heart i am divine coming in and the way i've kept it on seven of cups coming in it's like i'm no longer going to feel guilty or undermine myself just because i have been very brave at showing my authentic side my heart that i did love with an open heart and i don't need to close off anymore i see love and um i just got very choked up i see love and um vulnerability as a strength is also coming in believing in yourself 
I choose to transform my life resolving past issues with strength courage and will power This is another affirmation coming again for you guys Anything else I embrace the love and power of my cherished of my cherished self I honor my divinity again appreciation coming in i create positive actions through the cycle of change personal transformations are happening and this time around in the month of september or whenever you seeing this you got attracted to it you are at the end paying attention to yourself and honoring yourself and that's really really beautiful in a clarity which is also coming in and it's helping you advance forward because you're being assertive when it is required benevolence energy benevolent energy is coming through let's look into the charms So firstly the one which i was drawn to was the 50 cent coming in 2002 and a woman or someone riding a horse there's a lot of abundance which is coming in unexpected windfalls also could be coming through this will be a very financially enriching time which is why we also have the finances and career which propped up but take the time to enjoy life also take a breather is also coming in let's not burn ourselves out we are being very efficient but let's just take the time to also breathe that will be like you know it's like you'll be able to pump in pump in more efficient work is also coming through okay efficiency i've gotten stuck on efficiency we have a leaf also coming through autumn or changing leaf turning a leaf new chapters changes which are coming in which will really really benefit you and we have the steampunk also again like that missing piece or how things are lining up fixing in your timeline um i feel like how things are working in together how past experiences helped you shaped you and put you in this situation now where you where things start working in your favor where you start understanding why certain things had to happen because fruitions are coming in we also have the two coils coming through with like an s and this reminds me always about the kundalini kundalini rising could be happening um spiritual awakening could be happening it will be very very beneficial to listen to seven chakra chants for you sacral chakra and solar plexus chakra energy is also coming in we have an angel or a pixie on a crescent someone is dreaming about you something that you dreamt of wished for will also be coming in and angels are with you overlooking you guiding you is also coming through we have friendly coming in with aquarius and today is the full moon in aquarius yes i love it i love it i like and we have friendly also coming through could be like a platonic relationship turning into something more romantic or like you know you finding your soul tribe also and that is empowering you making you feel more connected with people you actually vibe with you are finding your tribe or reconnecting with them and maybe due to the fact that birthday is coming in but some people that you haven't even spoken for for a very long time from your past could be coming in reaching out to you with the excuse of your birthday that is also coming in but just keep an open mind let's not get fixated on anything this is a very very explosive time for you like it's really really good very thriving time things the mojo coming back and i love that for you all so i have taken a lot of time if you've been through the whole reading thank you so much i love you i don't know you but hey i love you 
and happy birthday to you in advance and belated too. Until next time, love, light, healing, empowerment, beautiful blessings and abundant opportunities to you all. Om Namah Shivaya. Keep that vibe. Hi, my lovely moons. Shukriya for watching.